All right, write your name on him. How do you spell my name? I'm Star. <laughs> You're gonna need to write it bigger than that. They're gonna be able to see it. crazy family so Liam is uh, getting ready for science camp it's like a camp through their school that they go to for three days and they just get to do like science stuff and learn different activities and that kind of thing so Liam was really excited to go but now he's kind of feeling bittersweet like he's kind of feeling sad because Logan's not able to go so part of him you can tell is like I don't know if I want to go and I'm like but it's about the experience and you're gonna have so much fun and you can come and tell Logan all the stuff you learned and show him things that you learned so he's still feeling a little uh, about it but I know he's gonna have a great time sorry it's kind of loud I'm standing outside and there's there's cars next to me um, but we got to get him packed and we have a whole list of things we need to put together so let's go do this grandma and Aunt Bonnie are gonna sign Logan's cast Logan was not able to go to school today because his wheelchair is not in yet, but I was hoping it either comes today or tomorrow, Mom. and then he can go back to school. Mom, you should have one of those I know, but he can't because it's like casted all the way up. Oh, we look out and poor Maddie dropped her toy in the pool, and look what she's trying to do. She was trying to walk across the net. What are we doing? Did your pool, f your toy fall in? She will sit for an hour. She's gonna sit for an hour trying to get to this thing. So let's see if I can save her. I got you, Maddie, I got you. Oh, she sees it. You know what's funny is it's gonna be just as wet. You're not gonna know is it wet or is it slobber? Ew, probably a mixture. Both. Both. <laughs> Yay! Woohoo! Watch her go drop it back. In the Do not bring that in the house till it's dry. <laughs> hey, Crystal, she wants to. Play. I'm good. Do you have good hiking shoes? No, I do not. Okay, we will get those at Walmart. Perfect. If your arms floated. <laughs> so we were just saying it's funny because Logan and Liam are kind of similar that if they look at something and they don't like love it, they'll put it on like, it doesn't, it doesn't fit. fit. And I'm like, what? <laughs> but it actually does. You're looking good though. You're all geared out for snow minus the shorts. Minus the shorts. <laughs> Did you get socks? No. You got to pack some socks. Oh, we got sunscreen and bug spray. We put whatever we could together and now we are headed over to Walmart just to get, he needs to be able to pack a lunch. Do you know what you want to pack tomorrow? Kind of lunch? No? It has to be in a sack. Oh, it's a sack lunch. So it can't be anything that needs to be kept cold. Yeah. So no Lunchables. Okay, we'll figure something out. So we need to do that and then we just have a couple more things on his list. All right, what did you decide to pack in your lunch? Peanut butter jelly sandwich, Pringles, Slim Jim, Gushers, Dr. Pepper. Perfect. So if you are wondering the little bruise on Liam's, by Liam's eye, he got a little crazy in the bouncy house too. <laughs> you guys got wild this season. I think we wait. I think we don't do bouncy houses for a while. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> you guys got too wild on it. All right, it's the next morning. We are packing Liam's lunch. We gotta make his sandwich. And then we are going to be dropping on, when we drop everyone off at school today is when they'll load the buses and go off to camp. We got some good stuff, huh? Well, Liam picked out good. Yeah. He did good, Liam. <laughs> everyone wants to pack a lunch today now. Especially this. This is, this is the best That's thing ever. That's not good. This is the best thing ever. But it's not healthy for you. You want peanut butter and jelly? 
Cause when you're around, I know it's true. Ooh, ooh, the way you make me feel is so good, baby. So good, so good. Every single day we spend a part, I wanna be with you. This morning it was a struggle because Aurora's not feeling good and she's been like coughing all night and stuff. So we're gonna keep from her home from school. Rylan and Jake have an orthodontics appointment, so they're not going to school. Well, they'll go to school a little bit later today. And then Logan's still not going because he doesn't have his wheelchair yet. So, it's just Brody and Liam today. Ah, <laughs> All right, have so much fun. I miss you. We're hugging before we get to the buses so all your friends don't see, don't worry. Oh wait, it's close on us! <laughs> Go a little wild. No shave November is over! Today is December 1st. This is the before. He was doing no shave November, which a lot of you in the comments called it Movember. Apparently which that's is the name in Europe. The UK and all of that. Canada, so that's so cool. But, um, so he is going to be donating, or we're gonna be donating money to. I'm gonna do a prostate cancer research. Um, I need foundation. to find one. Found, yeah, yeah, foundation. I don't know of one yet, so I gotta do some research on that. But. So, if you know of any really good foundations that the money goes to the right places, comment them down below, and we'll pick one of those and we'll donate. Oh, look at the dog. <laughs> she wraps herself in everything. Hey, I need my. <laughs> I need it. I need it. We gotta cut his ear. Sadie, drop it. There we go. Oh, Maddie's wanting hair. A lot of you said though that you really like it and you don't want him to shave it. Straight, so yes. So I've I've been really wanting a straight razor shave. I've never I'm, done one. No. I've not done a straight razor. I'm, I'm, but I, I'm torn I'm because I do like it to some point but it's gotten so long that it keeps getting like in my mouth and i'm not used to that but it is past the point where it's itchy so i'm like do i keep it do i not keep it so we're going to just trim it up and then he can decide on whether he wants to keep it or not because i feel like down here that all needs to go but i i've never cut his beard before and i don't know we're gonna try our best we're gonna do it and if all else fails i'll just shave it all off so. Sounds like it's almost dead. Yeah, this one's dead. You need batteries? Oh. Hold on, I have another one. What type of battery? Oh yeah, this one's better. And how far up do you go? I mean, you need to look at a picture. Oh, you should have done that before we started. Let me see, look at me. Better. <laughs> <laughs> You don't have a hairy neck. I feel like it needs to go up higher though. Do you think Joe will let me cut his too today? Probably not. So Joe has been growing his beard for, I think he said three years now. Okay. He's pretty attached to it. He wants it to be worth something when he actually cuts it. We need to do a challenge. That if yeah. he loses the challenge. Well, it's a good challenge that you guys would be willing to support or get in on try to get him to shave his beard. At least trim it. That's why I'm saying, will he let me trim it? If I do a good job, of course, maybe. It's just, it's kind of splotchy, like just the way it's grown in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to decide what number to do. Five millimeters. Bristol's secret celebrity crush is about to whip out a picture. Like, no, I'm not. This is what it looks like. <laughs> Are you shaping me in the look of another man? <laughs> Wait, I said short bread. <laughs> I said a short beard. <laughs> I was confused when I was filming food on your phone. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, please stop filming. I don't think I've ever looked up the word beard before. So I feel like this is a good length we got to. It's a five millimeter. But this side is like thicker than this side is more like patchy. So I'm like, do we cut it down more so that we're even? The last time I grew out facial hair, I was I'm looking at. in my early 20s, and I I ended up shaving it to like right here and only growing out like this because I think it was patchy. I don't know. Do you think that's cute? That's too short, huh? It's pretty short. That's really short. That's not my celebrity cut. I don't even know who these are. <laughs> I just looked up. Uh, or 
Look at there's a whole little like tool thing, a beard neckline. <laughs> Or we could go more Johnny Depp, where it's just the middle. I didn't know this was like such a thing. Follow your heart. Follow your heart. Like this. <laughs> All right. You ready for the after? I feel like about like a week or two in, it was like the perfect length. So that's the length, there it is. I feel like it's really good. I even out the sides like the best that I could. This one's still a little patchy, but I feel like it'll grow, hopefully. But I don't know, I think it's a good length. I'm gonna clean it up with my actual Yeah, razor with his actual here. razor. But, but yeah. yeah, I like it. Yay, it's not as prickly over your lips. <laughs> Let's see how she did. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. I actually kind of like it. Yeah, it is definitely better cleaned up for sure. So it has been quite the morning. I've already had so much go on and it's only 10 o'clock, 10.30. So Logan was supposed to go back to school today because all the kids are back in school, but that wheelchair, his wheelchair has not been delivered. So the doctor really wanted him to have a wheelchair at school because the cast he has isn't load bearing at all. And he could do crutches, but if one of the kids bumps him and knocks him over and then he has to put weight on it to catch himself or anything like that, they just don't want to risk that at this point. So we were supposed to have a wheelchair delivered through insurance, but we are still waiting on that. And I don't want him to miss too much of school. And I wanted him to practice on it a little bit before sending him to school in the wheelchair. So we're just gonna run over to like a CVS or Walgreens and just buy like a cheaper wheelchair while we wait for the insurance one to come in. That way he can start practicing and hopefully be able to go to school tomorrow. So we'll see how this goes though. All right, let's go teach him how to use a wheelchair. Do you even know how to use a wheelchair? Uh, yeah, for the most part. Ooh. Okay, there's a problem though. So this, Logan's leg is stuck straight. And so this is intending if your leg was bent. So we're trying to figure out if there's some way that we can like create a shelf or something so that his leg is supported. I don't know. Let's go try him on it and see if it'll work. The new wheels are here. Let's go. <laughs> All right, but we're worried because we don't know if your leg's gonna rest properly here. Put these up for you. Actually, it's not bad. It's actually not bad at all. He does have like a curvature. Because can't you adjust it to be higher? Well, I don't think that, because you want it to rest on it a little well, bit. We can does it hurt on your leg? Does it feel like it's like pinching on the back of your leg right at the top, or is it comfortable? It's comfortable. It's comfortable. Okay, okay wheel yourself somewhere. Okay, so. <laughs> Just see if you can do it and how it works. Is that side high enough? Or you need yeah, it high enough? it's high It's comfortable? Okay, so. <laughs> you have two You're burning locks. Out. Joe locked it here. See this? Anytime you're getting That's in why you're out, not moving. always lock it. Push this forward, pull it back, that would lock it. So if you were run, rolling down a hill uncontrollably, you could grab these two and bring them back slowly, and it would stop you because it locks the wheels. Stop. That's locked. That's unlocked. Or if you yank it right, you could do it. There's like one on this side, too. Let's not do so the power slide. You can use both to turn faster or you can just do one to turn slower. Okay, so if, say you wanted to turn right where you're at, you would spin this one backwards, this one forward. Yeah. So roll backwards. Might be tough on the carpet. Yeah. Don't run over your Christmas tree. <laughs> there you go. We didn't need that Christmas tree. We might need to move it like more yeah, in the corner. 
Max, he's got to do it. He's got to do it. Let him do it. He's got to figure it out. I know. <laughs> Logan has the best siblings, so anytime he's needed to be carried or like anything, they're like, I got you. But I really want him to learn and do really good. You're good. I'm going. Go all the way to my bathroom. You're pretty fast. Is it easier than the crutches? Yep, way. Way easier? <laughs> now you can get places. Let's see you maneuver into a doorway. Because you're going to have to do that at school. Uh. <laughs> no, you're okay. Keep going. You need to... <laughs> you need to angle it a little bit, but it's okay. There you go. Keep going over that hump. There you go. Ah. Good job! You did it! Got this, Logan. How's your leg feel? It's good. It's good? Is it itchy yet? It has been itchy so many times. <laughs> I My used part. to stick a hanger down itch. there to yeah, itch. Yeah, I was like, you can't get anything in there because it's so far down. I know. Okay, cool things. Okay, start. we're gonna practice with the wheelchair for a little bit. We'll see you in a minute. So it is the next day. Logan did so good in his wheelchair yesterday. So he was excited to go to school today. We dropped him off. Aaron and I, it was a whole team effort to get him out of the car and get the wheelchair and get the hole. But he did so good. And I'm really happy that he's on his, road, on his way to recovery. And thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.